Hi, boys and girls. Are you ready to learn? Welcome to Salamander Clubhouse, where learning is fun. Hello, hello, and welcome to you. Hello, hello, and how do you do? How are you today? Learning is fun. Let's have some All fun. you have to do is try. You can do it. Happy faces on, big smiles. Big smiles. You can do it if you try. Come along and learn with me. Miss Lou. Hello, friends, and welcome to Salamander Clubhouse. My name is Miss Lou. Now, I usually have my friend Sally with me today, but I think she's a bit busy. So I have another friend joining us. Very special one. We usually start by singing our ABCs, but before we can do that, we have to put on our thinking caps. Are you ready for some thinking today? I know I am. Uh, whew, that was nice and tight. I hope you have yours on. Okay. Let's start by singing and signing the alphabet together. If it's your first time with us, don't you worry. You'll catch on really quickly. Are you ready? Let's try it. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T U V W X Y and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? I think you already did, so thank you for joining along. Today, I have a new letter. And this letter is right behind me on my whiteboard. You guessed it. Uppercase and lowercase t. T makes the sound t. Now I know I promised that you would meet a very special friend. Are you ready to meet our friend? I think he's ready to meet you. Hi, Miss Lou. Hi there, Timothy. Timothy the tiger starts with T. How are you today? I'm a bit tired, Miss Lou. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Did you not get enough sleep last night? No, I didn't. Hmm. I think I'll just go and sit by the whiteboard and then when you come by, I'll be ready to print the T's and count with you. Oh, that sounds like a great idea. Okay, Timothy, you go and get some rest. Bye, friends. I'm so glad Timothy joined us and he will be back just a little bit later when we work on the letter T together. Since I have a couple of T words right here, why don't we look at those first? Two. The word and number two starts with T. And t -t train. Train starts with the letter T. Do you hear that? There goes the train. Doo -doo. I know another word that starts with T. Turtle. Turtle starts with the letter T. And it just so happens that I have a poem about a turtle. How about you follow along and we read it together. Turtle, turtle, slow but strong has a hard shell that protects it 
and four legs to help it move along. This creature dates back to the time of the dinosaur. That means over 200 million years ago. A hatchling is what a baby turtle is called and they eat two to three times a day. Turtles love the water and spend most of their time there, swimming in their own special way. Turtles are reptiles like alligators and snakes. Some turtles can pull their heads into their shells when they need to feel safe. I like that poem about the turtle. There were a lot of facts in there. Did you know that a baby turtle is called a hatchling? I didn't either. Look what we learned together. Are you ready for some more thinking and learning and doing and working together? How about you grab something to write with? We will practice our letter T and we will play I spy and if we're lucky, maybe Timothy the tiger will be joining us. Are you ready? Let's go. Okay, thank you for joining me and thank you, Timothy, for joining us too. Let's read our poem about the turtle once again and then we'll play I spy. Let's begin. Turtle, turtle, slow but strong, has a hard shell that protects it and four legs to help it move along. This creature dates back to the time of the dinosaur. That means over 200 million years ago. A hatchling is what a baby turtle is called and they eat two to three times a day. Turtles love the water and spend most of their time there, swimming in their own special way. Turtles are reptiles like alligators and snakes. Some turtles can pull their heads into their shells when they need to feel safe. The letter T. Okay, let's count all the T's that we can find. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five and six, hmm, seven and eight, and nine and ten and eleven. Eleven T's so far. Twelve and thirteen. I spy fourteen and fifteen and sixteen and seventeen. Eighteen and nineteen and twenty T's. Twenty-one, twenty-two. Hmm, twenty-three. 24, 25, 26. I spy 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. I spy 33 and 34 and 35 and 36. I spy 37, 38, 39 and 40. Hmm, 41. I spy 42, 43, 44, 45. Wow, I spy 46 and 47, 48, 49, and 50. I spy 51 and 52. Wowee! I think that's a record. 52 letter T's in our game I Spy. Fantastic! Time for some printing. Uppercase and lowercase t. Just like here. And remember, we always start our letters from the top, either one way or the other. Now, because it's the letter T, we're going to go across and down, just like that, across and down for the uppercase T. 
just like that. For our lowercase t, we are going to do the down motion first and then a little line right in the middle. There you go, just like that. T for tiger and T for top and T for train and the number two. T R A I N spells train. T W O spells two. Great job, friends. Thanks, Timothy. Great work, friends. I really enjoy it when you work with me and we learn to print and we learn to read and we rhyme and we sing. Well, right now, I have a new number for you and it's a special one. Want to see? Look behind me. Right here. It's the number 20. Do you know what that means? That's right. We have now filled two 10 frames. One, two. And guess what? The word 20 starts with the letter T. 20. It actually has two T's in the word. All right. How about you join me and we work on the number 20 together. Are you ready? Let's go. Friends, this is a very exciting number. The number 20 that also starts with the letter T. How about we trace the number 20? Now all of our teens had a one in front. This time we have a two and a zero. That makes 20. Always starting from the top around and down for our two and then a nice big circle-y zero. Two and a zero. That makes 20. Good job, everyone. 20. Okay, now we are going to fill our 10 frames. Watch what happens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We know that one ten frame is already filled. Let's count on. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. We have now filled two ten frames. Ten and ten more make twenty. Let's try doing it another way. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten tally marks. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty tally marks. Ten and ten more make twenty. I think I'm going to make, hmm, check marks today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty tally marks, twenty check marks. Great job, friends. We did it. We made it to the number 20. Didn't everyone do such a great job today? Timothy agrees with me. I think you all did a wonderful job working on the letter T, 
special name, Timothy the Tiger, and working on the number 20. Wow, you did wonderfully. All right, it's time for us to say goodbye right now, and we will see you soon right here in Salamander Clubhouse, and I bet Sally will be back joining us. All right, Timothy, would you like to help me sing the goodbye song today? Yay! Yay! All right, let's do it together. See you later, alligator, in a while, crocodile. Give a hug, ladybug, blow a kiss, jellyfish. See you soon, big baboon, out the door, dinosaur. Take care, polar bear, wave goodbye, butterfly. Oh, Timothy, thank you for making a butterfly with me. And thank you, friends, for joining us in Salamander Clubhouse. See you soon. Bye-bye.